Back to the Future Zero, the invention of the DeLorean DMC-12 time machine. Doc and Marty are younger in the movie using masks to make them look younger on camera. Doc works for a living company as a researcher scientist who happens to work in a particle research acceleration lab as his spare time. He's working on a pro product or prototype or project to do with the type of laser that shrinks and resizes an object. He is also working on the famous time machine in its early stages. He is not quite finished yet and can resize the car from a small prototype to a full-size machine. He takes a USB pen to work one day with the, with the cosmic genes of a car design flowing round the pen drive to work one day with the cosmic genes. Inside a device, its molecular structure stu 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 stuck in cyberspace once he connects it to the factory's main room where he can view the main room from the control room. He rebuilds the DMC cryogenically. Little does he know that the time machine can be copied onto another device and replicated. Doc finds out whilst meddling with the device in a lab that have an USB pen connected to the iPad. He drops the iPad in the vault room by accident. The concept for the vehicle or automobile was designed by his friend Marty at high school during his lunch hours. Marty took the design to Doc years back, hoping that Doc would build the time machine. Build it as of yet. It still doesn't work anyway. Doc can't get the molecular structure of the device to build the way he wants it to. So he's been back and forth out of the nuclear discharge room, trying different settings on the laser builder. Well, does he realise that the iPad with his iron on plus the USB stick got dropped out of the, his rip pocket? Because he has earplugs in when he runs a computer system analysis from the other room, it rebuilds the iPad, in fact melts the destroyed iPad that he accidentally stood on into the time machine, or he doesn't find out until later that the iPad can disappear into somewhere else and become invisible to the human eye. As soon as his successful moment happens, an evil Doc from the future has his army of evil tunes, including an evil Marty, party go a charge in and steal the idea from the lab. Also, they test aircraft and UFOs and all sorts of fa failing machinery in his gi giant metallic looking chemistry warehouse, making liquid metal into all sorts of robots and powerful futuristic ideas ready to control the world. In case of warfare, anyway, the boss of the company takes the information away, which is basically a copy of a, a very important plutonium document, cryogenically structured system. The evil doc disappears, not before freezing everybody and everything in Hill Valley. And good doc and Marty now have to drive mm -hmm. through Hill Valley and through a virtual reality theme park where they are f faced with pure evil, where their time machine gets tested, basically. It cryogenically rebuilds when attacked by evil docks guards who are reptilian beasts brought to life on an old abandoned theme park. They push the DeLorean through the ghost tra train type rides, all bend and swoop re reality to stop the evil doc from taking his creation of plutonium vehicles into building a giant drone to take over the world. To do good, Doc and Marty have enough time to stop him from destroying Hill Valley and restore the place. This is all pre Back to the Future 1, namely Back to the Future 0, the fourth instalment in our final adventure.